this project e crime reporting developed in asp.net c sharp with sql server to configure this project you need to install latest version of sql server sql server management studio we are using sql server express edition and asp.net we are using visual studio 2017 community edition so first once you purchase this project you will get uh, these files this database script then this source code then this installation guide project report and synopsis so first we will uh, configure our database for that uh, you can install any version of sql server i am using sql server 2014 express edition so i will first start sql server management studio sql server 2014 management studio you need to use that script file or database backup file i am using script file i will just copy this path okay so first i have to connect my database then i will go to database and right click click on new database and give you the database name in trying to be click on okay so it will create one new database without any table there is no table there so i will use this script file click on file open then again file Paste the path and select that DB script file. So I am using eCrime DB. So I'll just or you can use eCrime. Then you have to create eCrime only. Okay. So this is the all create table and insert statement is there. So I'll just execute this script file. So if you refresh this table, so all table will come. So this is the user master table. In this project, there is three type of user. One is admin user, one is department, and citizen. So admin can create that department, and department can create citizen. So once citizen uh, registered, the so citizen can log in and post, log in and post their uh, means uh, that missing or any FIR or any any registration, and department means police department. He will work on that, and he will uh, update the status. And admin can overall see all the details. Okay. Now, once the database is created, you have to configure your uh, project. So, for this, I will copy the source folder path. Now, I will use Visual Studio. So, first, start your Visual Studio. I am using Visual Studio 2012 edition. You can use any uh, Visual Studio available in your system. So just please copy the source uh, folder path. Then click on File. Then open website. Paste the path. Then click on Open. So once the project is open in your Visual Studio. You have to just configure your uh, connection parameter in web dot config file. Click on Solution Explorer. So you will get that all. So just double click that config file. Okay. So you have to just uh, change the data uh, source name and the database name. So where you will get the data? So just go to SQL Server again. Right click on the database, click on Properties, and copy this name name section. Copy it and go. It is already there. So you have to paste there. And DB name. DB name you will get there. So up my DB name is Ekram DB. Just copy it and just paste it. 
in save this file. And just set that default dot uh, space is your default page. That's it. Okay. So if you want to change anything, design or anything, you can do change in your uh, like this. Uh, welcome to it online crime reporting copyright. This is a footer text. So if you want to change like online e crime. Now start the project. Before that, you have to set the default space as a setup starter page and start. For user password, you can go to user table and this is that login ID, this email ID is login ID and this is that uh, department. So first I will uh, click on uh, login as a admin. Okay. So admin is that user ID and password is one to two. So I will, this, this is a footer text and this is that following text. So I will click on login. Properly one two three. Okay. Now manage users. So you can see that admin can see however that uh, users is available in the system. Because admin can create a department, police department. So I'll just click on that department name. So I'll put the name. So make it. Y number is put my name two three two three two five four email ID location. It is coming from master so you can add location submit. So new user is created department. Now this user can log in with this email ID and password. So I log in with this. So whenever new user created default password will be just refresh this table, you will get the password. Default password would be 1 to 3. So I log in with this. So click on log out. And password is 1 to 3. And this is the new department, police department. So we can do registration of citizen. Citizen name. So citizen is it will be Sharma. Citizen is created. Now this uh, citizen can log in and register the complaint. So I log in with this my ID. Log out. Now citizen access the portal and citizen login. Now citizen now start com start the log complaint. So we will complaint type like uh, say missing person you need to add. Submit. Missing person name, say missing name Suresh. So you can upload photo of that person. Suresh. So next up, sample. No name Suresh, last name is Mr. Well number. Okay. Missing name. Skin color, white, black, address, seven dollar. Now this uh, Ravi Sharma citizen, I log a complaint that one person is missing, named by Ravi Sharma, Bhiyo. 
so you can see that image also okay now department will log in and department will update the status okay citizen can and log in other also like other robbery case so you can fill the robbery case also. like why i did the robbery card so i was in new location or oh, now i am find did the robbery account mind first open so mobile yes yes now this is registered for me So this person Ravi Sharma logged to complain one missing citizen and robbery. Okay. Now we can see the complaint history also. This is the complaint history actually. Missing citizen. Suppose other person is logged a complaint of missing citizen. All missing citizen is uh, showing in this grid. So you can see and you can confirm also. Like this uh, two are already registered and this one registered by Ravi Sharma. now if department is logging department also see all the complaint register in his department and he can perform the action now the department person this uh, department which i have created right now so department 1 is logging now Log out. Department will see all the complaint, and he can do the action. Now, citizen missing citizen. Manage missing citizen. Now, this one is registered by new registration, so he can see that complaint. Now, this is the details. Missing citizen details. Missing at market. Now, if want to update that uh, status. So you can do the edit. Click on edit. On you can select the file also. Like the person use files, and then you can want to add and on question. So, so now this this one is removed from this list. Okay. Now complain also. Will complain. This is a body. So I can see the view. Or if I want to update the status, update status. This is a body one. So I need to edit. And the status closed. Once I click on close, I have to submit the criminal name, criminal one. Or I can add the criminal also. Manage criminal data. So then, to add a new criminal data, add a new criminal, a criminal name, and the last name is yes. Sharma. File to so criminal photo. So once now, if we update status and edit, we'll get that. Criminal data, criminal funding, funding for this kind of thing, and submit. Yes, and go. Now, suppose you want to search any data, complaint, or missing complaint, complaint number. Suppose you know. All complaint data will come. Now the person who logged the complaint, if he go and he log in the system, he will get the all the details. Suppose that person log in that is citizen. This is the one. The patient. If you log in, you 
and he can sh see the status complaint or complaint history. So you log it to complaint. Probably it is closed. So if you go to view, so you will see his complaint, and you can see that who is the uh, criminal and all the details. Like the same one, the view missing citizen. If you go to the view, all details will come. And admin can see all the department data. So if you go to admin login. Like you can see all the all the complaint. You can see report also. Like how, what is the number of count? A fire count. And you can view all the complaint like this. Or you can filter the location wise. You can filter the data also. So this project uh, is the admin is the main person. You can create the department uh, details, department users, and department can add the citizens. A citizen register the complaint. Department will do the action on that. Like he can close the status, he can update the criminal data, and admin can view all the details of all the location, all the users. Okay, so this project once you buy it, you will get the all the files. This file, database file, source code, installation guide, report, synopsis, and you can configure this with any Visual Studio and any SQL Server version you have. Okay.